Fire coral gets its name for the effect it has on those that brush up against it. Anything that touches it gets a feeling of intense burning from the tiny barbs which launch themselves on anything that brushes against it. Although it is called a fire coral, it is not a coral in the true sense of the word, but is actually a hydrozoan or hydroid and is more related to sea jellies than coral. Fire coral are found in warm tropical waters around the world. You can tell fire coral by their colour, which is a mustardy colour with white tips. Fire coral takes on many forms depending on where it is located. Where the current is not so fast, it will develop thin branches that form a lattice. If there is a strong current, they will develop thick columns or staghorn-like branches. Or, if there are heavy waves, or if there is a super strong current, it will then develop a thin, encrusting layer. They have a very strong partnership with Suzanthalae algae, which happens to live under their clear skin. This algae gives the fire coral food using the energy from the sun, and the algae will then feed off the waste of the fire coral. In return, the coral gives the algae oxygen and protection. They live in areas of shallow water, in reefs that are exposed to light in varied currents. Where there are strong currents, they will live on the edge of reefs, on the top of steep drop-offs, or on the reef face. They then use nematocysts to shoot down the animal or plant, and then, with their fine hairs and mucus, carry it to the animal's mouth. They are able to reproduce when a female or male medusa or an adult that is free swimming leaves its polyp colony by budding or dividing. It will then swim away from the colony and reproduce by releasing eggs or sperm which are fertilised by another fire coral medusa and a hairy bean shaped planula. Then what happens is that the planula swims until it finds a reef to live on and will grow into a flower shaped polyp. The polyp attaches to a solid surface and goes through a, a sexual reproduction and makes an exact copy of itself without eggs and sperm. Polyp is able to make these identical animals by budding and they keep dividing to form an entire fire coral.